Oh, look at all of these eggs. Oh, they're not loose. They're part of the basket. Just let anybody into this place. <laughs> is that a magnet? It's got a magnet on it? Is that brass? Oh, wow, it's heavy brass. So far, this is all that Mikey has in his cart. And this is for Doreen. <gasps> oh, look at that. Look at that. It is Wednesday. That means something around here in Las Vegas because our Goodwills do 40% off. 40% off! <laughs> it's a really fun thing. Although it is really, really hot. Our, uh, let, let me just show you. 114, 114 at five o'clock in the afternoon. Show a little toasty. But it's air conditioned inside, so we're gonna we're gonna get in there. We're gonna have some fun. Now I am in super picky mode because I will be moving soon, one way or another. And if you haven't been following my little saga, yeah, you should subscribe. You should follow along. This is gonna get interesting. I uh, doing a little house hunting, and I've already included that. Um, I don't know if I've gotten the place that I included in a video, but it's it's the one that I'm crossing my fingers for. And I will share the journey with you guys as we go. How do you move an eBay business? How do you do it? I'm, I'm follow my journey. Hit that subscribe button. I'm going to show you just how it's done. All right, with that, we're going to get our little picky selves inside. Are we going to get shop done, Danny? Let's get shop done. Okay, okay Carrie, what's the first thing we got to do? We got to go find our lucky card. We're going to one, card it, so we're one card it. All right. Well, let's see if she picks the one I'm thinking. All right. She's got a feeling about that one. All right, they have a whopping amount of Christmas stuff out. So I guess we kind of have to start there. What, why are their light parts all out of them though? They're like stripped of their lightage. That looks like work to me. <laughs> I'm not about the work. <laughs> Let's see. Let's look for vintage. Vintage, vintage Christmas. That's what we want. Let's see what if we can find. The Rudolph Company. Not seeing anything vintage. Just very modern. Lots of mugs. Yeah. Little trees. Okay. I mean, there's some cute stuff, but just nothing real good for resale at this moment. What are these little bricks? What are these little? Oh, they're just, that's what they are. They're little cardboard bricks. Oh, the little Charlie Brown Christmas trees. Yeah, they can do okay. They're not mind-blowingly good, so um, I'm going to pass. But look at this little guy. Wow, what's going on with... Why does he have a stopper? Maybe they just put that in there so he stands nice. But that's a real urchin skeleton. And, then, you know, I got a thing for my little sea life creatures. We actually have an urchin named Jack. And uh, for 99 cents, that's going in the cart. Oh, and Lucite geese. Those are also not Christmas. See, I love looking in a section and finding things that don't really belong in that section. He is $2.99. We will get him. These are really good sellers for me. Goodness. This little candle. Oh, they are candle holders. Candle holders. Okay. 
I have sent Carrie to go peruse the very first row that still has some Christmas stuff. While I come over here on this last little row of Christmas stuff and find things that are not Christmas, like the little lucky cat. He's actually really nice for 99 cents. We are going to grab him. And let's see. I am not a fast cook. I am not a slow cook. I am a half fast cook. See, I had to say that slow so uh, nobody thought I said anything naughty. But that's funny. Oh, look at all these eggs. Oh, they're not loose. They're part of the basket. What? And it's like a hobby piece. Okay, it's big, it's heavy. It's not gonna sell for enough to make it worthwhile to deal with that, but I do kind of like it. I do like it. That looks like a Dorothy Thorpe style plate down here. I say style because I'm not sure this is hers. Um, but she does some of these really thin glass trays. I'm getting the feeling this is not that old. It is kind of cool though, with the little bees. Mm. It is $2 because it is half price. I don't know what to do. I like it. I like it. I wonder what you guys are saying right now through the screen. Are you saying buy it? It's got this little like edge thing here. Okay, I'm getting it. I have a dilemma right now because Carrie's got the cart and my arms are getting full. But that's okay. We'll go until we find like one more thing and I just have to put it down. Like I can put the kitty cat down and look at the pine cone squirrel candle. My goodness. And let's see, are you empty? And then this looks like it's, I thought it was supposed to be an owl candle holder with pumpkins, but it's, it's not. Oh, I see some kitsch. Let's see. And I say that because of the, the, the tacky green plastic holly in there, but that's like the only thing. I mean, the little toy soldiers, kind of cute, but meh, not enough there to really deal with. Not enough. Oh man, you know I have a weakness for these. Ooh. Wasn't me, wasn't me. I have such a weakness for these fake eggs. This one is a little crushed though. Actually, a few of them are crushed. Okay, that, that makes it easier for me to leave it. Cornucopia? What is this? Oh, he's missing something. He would have had like a seesaw there. It's unfortunate. I swear I want to come up with some projects to repurpose this stuff, come up with ideas to make it into something else because it makes me so sad that he's going to end up at the landfill. It just makes me so sad. I don't like it. So give me a J. Bunny, little little cubes. Oh, and a scarecrow. And there's some dolls up there. They don't look promising, though. Okay, let's look over here. There's some more real tacky. That's tacky vintage Christmas. That's not. No, it's not even. Oh. I thought that was one little musical thing, but it's not. Those are even like dollar store quality. Not good. Where's all the where's all the vintage? Where's all the vintage? We need us some vintage. Oh, he's got a cork bottom. He's not oh he's good. He's nice. Let's see that nice little piggy. He is uh, only $4.99 minus 40%. Yeah, he's got he's got some paint. So there's some paint wear. There's some crazing. But the price is right. And he's got his cork. So yeah, I 
I think that's a good one. You're poking him in the eye, Carrie. You're poking him in the eye. Carrie, what's all of this going on here? What is she? This is it a doll? Might be a, might be a doll. Oh, yeah. No. She's a. Oh my goodness. Yeah, she's a. I don't know if she's a Madame Alec. If she is, she's a newer one. Oh, we have loud children. This is a. Oh, I thought that was wood. It's not. It's just plastic. Yep. Just plastic. Oh. Is that like a fraternity? I don't know. It looks like a spaceship. It does look a little spaceshipy, but that's got to be like the symbols for a fraternity. I need to get away from this small child. He's giving me anxiety. Just let anybody into this place. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this little guy. He's a Boston Terrier. He's a little trivet. It is $2.99 minus 40%. So I think I will go ahead and get it. There's got to be a Boston Terrier lover out there. I also am digging this little miniature butcher block. I don't know why I'm digging it so much, but I'm... Is that a magnet? It's got a magnet on it? Hey. Oh, that would make sense. That would, a knife would sit on there. But it's got a... Oh, you do your lemons and limes? It's got... What does that say? Something teak. Siamese teak. Ernest. It's cool. It's cool. And it's half price. It's only $2. We're grabbing it. So Carrie is grabbing this. She looked it up and somebody's got it listed as lucite. I, it I really feels like it. ceramic to me. And they're calling it Soran, uh, so, Sopranos. Sopranos. Sopran it's a cigar ashtray. It is cool. Oh, look what else she got. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> she did it. She did it. She also rescued the little squirrel candle. <laughs> Is that brass? Oh, wow, it's heavy brass. That's heavy brass for $5. It's a little munched up. But you know what? I keep forgetting. It's $5 minus 40%. That's a really nice decorator vase. I'm grabbing it. She's trying to sing the uh, mermaid song here. Oh, she's gonna do her. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, does that come out? It does come out. Oh, that's so 70s. It is. 70s Mediterranean. It's footed. Carrie's got her. Carrie's got her. Her, her little clappy hands going over this. So Carrie's picking this one up for $10 minus. 40%. This is a little fascinating. I was going to say it's probably just a made in China one, but it's got a nice look to it. Got a TJ Maxx big black vase. It's not what we're looking for. Not what we're looking for. We are looking for bougier stuff than that. I think this is an Ikea piece. I need to go back to Ikea. I know I keep saying that. I just, I think I keep like telling myself and then see, I'll edit this and then I'll hear me say that again. I'll, I get it in my brain and like I get over to Ikea because you know you want to. What in the world is he? Okay guys, help me out here. What's missing on this guy? Or does, or does he go like that? Does he just sit like that? Is he a cork holder? His gills. I don't know. He's he's kind of a hot mess. I know. Somebody's going to tell me in the comments I left some priceless thing <laughs> on the shelf. Like, but I just don't get it. Mikey, we need to do that. We're going to find a safety pin. Ooh, this looks like Orifers. It is. Look at that. Right into there is our little signature. $3.99. We will be putting that in the cart. 
Let's see if there's any other goodies hiding in here. I don't see any there. And I don't see any there. That looks Italian. Are you Italian? Oh, you are modern and you are distributed by Family Dollar. I got fooled. Holy smokers. Now, once you get close up on it, you can see the painting job is not real great. Some shells. You know, I always got to look at the shells. I just gave all the hermit crabs a whole bunch of new shells. So they should be happy for a while. Well, look at this. Look at all this Himalayan coarse grade salt. You put it in a I bet that is not cheap. I'm actually going to look up and see how much that sells for. Most of the listings I find have sold from other countries and were in the 20 to $30 range with another 20 some dollars of shipping. So these are $5.99 minus 40%. I cannot go wrong. I'm grabbing them both. Oh, I bet these would have had like a string that, a chain that kept them, look, like there's, there's three of them. They would have been all hooked together. Although this one's kind of separate. Oh wait, this one's, this one's a standalone. And he is, someone, oh, the tag keeps turning as I turn it. $1.99. Hello, pretty, you're coming with me. All right. Anything else exciting over here? What is that? What is that? What is supposed to go there? I don't know. Oh, he's like a cell phone holder. That's what it is. That's what it is. It's a cell phone holder. Yeah, that's, that's what that is. That is interesting. Okay, on to the next time. Look at these guys. These are perfect for my Christmas in July sale that is coming up very soon. It is it is a week from this Friday. We'll be doing Christmas in July. So I'm going to grab these beautiful little owls for $3.99. And there's some angels in there too. So there we go. What are these? They have scriptures on them. Faith. Trust. Just missing some love. We're missing some love. Oh, if you need drink cozies, this is your place. My goodness. Oh, we are in the plastics. What you finding, Mikey? I found out that they color coordinate the plastics. Did they, they do that at every Goodwill? Not everyone, but most of them. Yes, they do color coordinate the plastics. Today was the first day I've discovered that. Oh. Did you look at this already? No. It's an Aladdin. I know. I was looking at the Keurigs. Oh. The Keurigs were nothing. This, this might be, might be good. It might be I'll good. So far, this is all that Mikey has in his cart. And this is for Doreen. All right. Plates and dishes galore. Little Avon Cape Cod. Those are pretty. Those are. Can't read what it says. I see Bavaria. Oh, maybe on the bowls it's a little bigger. Oh, they're made. No, I lied. They're made in Poland. Poland. I can't read what the word is above made in Poland, though. They're nice. But you know me, I'm not a big dishes person, so we'll leave those for somebody else. But there is a nice little silver overlay dish for 99 cents. Again, something that will go in my live sales quite easily, maybe even as a giveaway. So I'm going to grab that. Oh, well, hello there, Matrushka. She, I believe, is a singleton. You know what? I'm going to give her to Carrie to explore, but I think she's a single. How much is she? I mean, even, even as a single, she might be okay. Oh, yeah. If she was 99 cents, we'd do it. But am I so cheap? $3 minus 40%. So she's going to be like 219 Right? 
Is she worth it? Is somebody going to buy Or is she like $1.79? I can't remember the math there. I know, but she's got a kitty cat. Something's like pulling me to put her in the cart. I don't know why. I could do her as a giveaway. You could. Somebody would love her. All right. That's going to happen. Who knows? Maybe as we get over to the toy section, we're going to find the rest of her. We're going to find all her little buddies that go with her. That is an apple cork. Dominoes. Oh. They're very, very, very light, so not, not great. Oh, what's this one? Nope. It's a nope. What's this one? Slurred. You need a, you need a game to play? Oh, it was only four ninety nine at Ross. chickens. My snuggles are fierce. Okay. They're referring to a dog, I'm sure. All right. Anything else down here? I'm not seeing anything. Nothing too exciting in the mug. See, I keep seeing these are the um, Grayson Hall, and I keep seeing this one. I would have had a set by now had I been picking them up. Don't need it, though. Don't need it. Arizona Charlie's glasses. Not very exciting. Hmm. Oh. Now, why can't there be four? One more color. Because these are kind of nice in the different colors. Although, I just, picking it up, there's a little problem. They're super off balance. Hmm. They are only $2 each, though. Gosh, I wish there was one more. I need one more to make that a set. And I don't see it. I just don't. I'm going to leave them because it's super picky mode for me, which means that is something I am gonna leave. Let's see, a little jar here that's interesting. Oh, it's Avon. I would not have guessed that that was Avon. Wow, it's $3.99. Kind of really like it. I mean, it's super vintage Avon. There's a matching one at the end. Oh, is there another one down there too? Hmm. Gosh, this is where it gets tough to be picky. And look at this. It's another of the little silver. This one's $3.99, but it's a nice little um, double handled bowl. I don't know why I just love these. Just love these. Okay, we're grabbing that one too. There's that and piece of I'm holding I'm holding on to this in my hand because I'm a little I'm a little smitten and I have to see how much it speaks to me along the way. It looks like a little restaurant wear creamer. Let's see. Carrie likes to go ahead and try to guess what it is I'm gonna yep. grab off of the shelf. Danny Banks. <laughs> Let's see what this little guy is here. He's a Lennox. Would you believe that? He's a little Lennox. A little pink and cream. I like him. I guess it's live sale shopping night. Because I do cute. like him. He's cute. Do you? I think I see what she is referring to right there, maybe? Nope. Oh, this wasn't even the thing. Because this looks like, looks like Viking glass, but it doesn't feel like Viking glass. Ooh. The Dilemma. It's very lightweight. Um, the base has some weight to it, but the rest of it, ah, you know what, for five bucks, let's go. Is this a Port Mirian? It is not, it is World Market. Sometimes the World Market stuff fools me here. I'm gonna put it here so somebody can see that item that's behind there. Ooh, that's an interesting piece. 
produced for design pack made in China. Yeah. I know it looked better than that, but, and then I got to see who makes the little post office canister. Some of these can do quite well. Now it's not marked, so it's not the Lennox one. It didn't have the quality of the Lennox either. Gosh, look at that. That is sure pretty. Why do I like the big, large, obnoxious stuff? You know, I just really do. He is made in Italy. He's beautiful. He is beautiful, but got the chippies on it and it's big. And then here's another little piece of mid. Now see, this one has the right feel. This is the, the mid-century feeling glass, see? Oh, yeah. It does. Yeah. So what are the ridges in here for, Danny? I don't know. Um, it's a candle holder? Was it a candle holder? I'm not exactly sure. It's, it's, not, a, it's not a real exciting piece. I am going to leave it. Um, oh! Oh, was it red once upon a time? No, I don't know. Oh. Now I have a quandary. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to actually look these up. Because you know, I've, I've said this many times, Avon never made their own products. They used other companies, Westmoreland. I believe they used Fenton, Indiana Glass, Imperial Glass. They used all those companies to make them private labeled items. So let's take a peek and see if we can figure out if these have any value. Well, I'm kind of sad. These are only worth about 10 bucks each, so. I do have to leave them on the shelf, but I hope somebody will find them and love them. Oh, gosh. What in the heck? Oh, that's interesting. It's stainless steel, but it's, it's this big old honking knife. Shelf. I can't believe this is just sitting on the shelf either. It's, I know, it's a little scary. That's pretty good. It's only six bucks with that discount. I would put this down at my booth in a case. That's cool. What kind of little cooking upper? Oh, does this have... Well, that can't really be a temperature because it doesn't go up high enough. It only goes to 100. So what... Wow, that's a heavy... All right, we might need to look these up because... Lifetime guarantee. Usually anything with a lifetime guarantee is worth some money. So let's take a peek. So I did a quick look up on this. What did, what did we call it? Nutri... Nu oh, shoot. Nutri... Stahl. Whoop. Clanking around the glass. Nutri... Stahl. There we go. And uh, it's uh, really good stuff. So that one is $7.99. That one is... $14.99. This one is $9.99. And this one is $12.99 for the strainer. I don't know if the strainer's worth that much, but we're going to keep looking the shelves and see if we're missing any pieces. And I go from there. So we're grabbing all four pieces. Okay, I don't see anything else that that could have... Uh, gone in so I think that's it Carrie I think those are the pieces that we got and we will just be we'll just be happy with it but what else do I want you're crazy Ugh, I don't need any more composition books right now but if I did I would buy some Ooh, I have a thing for construction paper too have I ever mentioned that I don't know why I think it's a throwback to my childhood crafting days and just I don't know I get a warm fuzzy feeling when I see craft craft paper cardstock paper not cardstock what construction paper thank you that's the word I was looking for Carrie's um you got a selection up there you know you have a whole selection. I have dude heads.
heads. I have these little tiny alien heads. This one's got a long neck. That's oh, you difference. like her long neck. Okay. She well, looks a little mushed. Uh, yeah, she's a little, she's, she's a little, she's a little banged up. Kind of thinking that girl needs a good uh, attorney for her auto accident she was in. <laughs> Wilson Hoops, Spirit of 76, Evan Rosenstan, Christmas Garland, mm. some cool, some cool uh, little craft kits down here. Oh, is this acrylic? <gasps> it's acrylics! Buck 99. They look pretty full. Gotta, if they're full, that's a good price. And as you can imagine, in my household, we go through a lot of this. This is not full, though. It's not full. Nope, 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 nope. Not full. All right. I'm going to leave that for another artist person. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. Is there a year on this thing? Wow. That is just so 60s vibes to me. Yep. The cruel pillow kit. That might actually be worth something. And BYU Designs. What's BYU? It's, um, it's, um, Brigham Young. Brigham Young. Oh, it's 1977. Wow. This is really vintagey. Okay. So these are actually, oh, I found a date on these. They're 1970s. I saw a date somewhere. And these are all the same company and they are $1.99 each. So I'm grabbing those four. I may even just put them all in a lot together. And then these are Needles and Hoops Sampler Kit. Now I couldn't find a date on these, but the sample date they put on this was 1966, which makes me think these got some age on them. Uh, so there are three of those that are all the same. So that makes for an easy listing. And I did get this, like, this might be a tough sell, the BYU um, pillow, but it's 1977 and it's, it's all there. So for 99 cents, we got that guy. And then I'm getting the crazy 1960s cruel pillow kit for $1.99. All of it is minus 40%. Can't go wrong. You rejected her. I, you know what? She's sitting there. She's sitting there so sad now. Okay, let's see what we got in the art over here. I don't know why I am just picking up so much art again lately. I have to start at least getting it on Cherish get some listed see anything exciting back there those are kind of cool very 70s kind of thing <gasps> oh look at that look at that holy smokers look at this black velvet painting Dated 1965. It's the real deal for $5.99 minus 40%. And then we got a horsey. Oh, no, she doesn't need it. She, you know, she doesn't watch my videos, so it's all good. She'll never know. I left the beautiful horse behind. I do feel guilt though. <laughs> I feel guilty. No feeling guilty. All right, I wish there was another uh, black uh, painting, black velvet painting there. What is that? Jude Law, Sky Captain and the World of Tomorrow, Summer 2004. All right, let's look in the littles and the frames. Brighten your Halloween with black cat cuteness. There you go. Oh, what's in the box? It's a front. Oh. Is it a frame or is it? No. It's actually a little piece of art. Oh, what? That's... It is a frame. I guess you can put your own thing in there, but somebody's got a... 
It's from Caesars. A fine, fine piece of art in there. Uh, oh, it's from Caesars? Mm -hmm. Well, then you know this was not cheap because there's mm -hmm. nothing cheap at Caesars Palace in Las Vegas. Fringe Studios is not a bad brand either. I don't see a price on it anywhere. Did I miss it? I don't see a price. Oh, $5.99. Yeek. Do I want to pay $5.99? I know it is. Okay, okay, okay. All right, I don't see anything else. I can't live out without except maybe a bunny. Maybe a bunny. Let's see you. Little canvas art bunny. Ugh. There is a name on there. Wow, it's tiny. No can read. Lisa Prudit or Fruitit? He's awful cute. Nope, 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 nope. Wow. I know. I'm not yeah, I know. I'm leaving him. I might need a Mercedes. You know, this might be my my next vehicle. It's really, really low on on gas. Or what is that? High gas. Actually, it's not a Mercedes. It's an Audi. Boy, I don't even know my cars. There's one interesting thing over here with the lamps. Kringle's Coffee House. I love the little windows and the scenes inside. It's a St. Nicholas Square. 2005. I'm sure some of these can do really, really well, but gosh, it's so big and bulky and I'm trying to limit the big and bulky stuff that I have to move. So I'm going to go ahead and leave this for somebody else. It's $7.99, so maybe somebody else will come in here and grab that. That, oh, it's so pretty. I remember my grandma had a desk like this in her, she had it in her dining room. Oh, so many memories. Is it dovetailed? No, they're not. They're kind of stapled together. Let's see one of the main drawers and see. Boy, that brings back memories though. Ooh. Oh, this is dovetailed. Yep. That's an old piece. That's Machine crazy. plane. Now, feel. remember we were yes. at that store in yes. the last video and the feeling the difference, knowing that that was a 1700s piece and you could feel like the ridgy right. ridges. But in here, it's like, it's super, super smooth. But, oh man, minus 40%. Oh, I do love it. Wow, look at the giant bean bag. Holy smokers. I kind of love it. <laughs> Let's do a little pillow talk. <laughs> oh, I don't see anything exciting. Wow, look at all the sleeping bags they've got. Holy moly. This is a must pick up for my peep crazy daughter, the one that lives in San Diego. Uh, so that is coming with me. Oh, it's the same song. What's he playing? I can't even. Oh, Zoot Ryan. Oh. Oh, that's probably that's that's probably copyrighted music, Mikey. We probably can't stay on there too long. <laughs> And if you've been following, you know that I'm looking for Disney stuff for my whatnot sale that I will be doing. I'm going to do a Disney one soon. And uh, this guy's just the perfect guy. He's a, he says special, wait, does it say special? Special edition? Limited, special edition, right there on his Tukey. All right, $4.99, Mickey's coming with me. And then I found this too. These things are like 20, 25 bucks if you buy them at the park. These little like spinner guys. It says Disney Parks right on there. I wouldn't pay five for it, but I'll do the 40% off. Take a chance on it. We're perusing through the purses on our way to the checkout and I spotted this nice leather 
steer hide. I mean, it's it's in really good shape, and it's got that that leather squeak. You know that the leather squeak. I don't know if you can hear that. Um, I love that leather squeak. Now it's twenty dollars, but it is minus forty percent, which is going to make it doable. And I am going to do that per se. I'm going to do a Disney. And I'm going to do a purse sale on Whatnot. If you haven't signed up for Whatnot yet, and you would just like $10 for checking it out, then uh, use the link that I have down in the description, and it will give you $10 to go and have some fun over on the Whatnot app. And then, of course, make sure you follow me to know when I'm going to do that sale. All right, I think we're heading to the checkout. This is my cart full of stuff. Oh, we shared a cart. We did good. We shared a cart. But uh, I'm going to tell you everything that I bought and what I paid and how much it'll sell for on eBay based on actual sold comps. I research everything to give you that information. So if you're out and about, you see that stuff, you know what it'll go for. All right. Stay tuned for that. And uh, we'll see you in the car. another fun and profitable trip to Goodwill and it was super fun that um, one of the employees came over and said I knew you'd show up in my store one of these times so uh, that was that was it's always fun it's always fun to meet you guys that watch the channel so never be afraid come up and say hi you can do that I hugged her 
Oh, <laughs> Carrie gave her. Carrie's a hugger. You, you I might. Her. You might get a hug from Carrie if you come. You up. will if you want one. I will not touch you if you don't like being touched. That's creepy. What? You hug me sometimes when I'm like. Rah, 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 rah. Because you need it. It's calming. <laughs> like this. There we go. I just give her a little pet. Uh, <laughs> you cracked me up. All right. We're headed out. Noah's cooking steak. <gasps> he just called and said, can I put the steaks on? I'm like, yep. I'm yes, almost home. So, mm -mm -mm. going home to just a little steak steak dinner from, from my boy. Excellent. Okay. So with that, you go be profitable. And make, make it fun. fun. Oh, they're over here. <laughs> we'll see you on the next one.